Greetings, 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 my V family all over the world. This is your chief. Welcome to the Wednesday message, week 16, 4 o'clock in the freaking morning. Chief is still switched on. It's been a crazy, crazy week since I spoke to you last Wednesday from the office. We are now planning global dominance, guys. Everyone is flying, 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 flying around the world. We are coming to you. All right, life is getting back to normal. I'm so excited. I've been speaking to Dato Sri Vijay about our travel plans, London, Switzerland, Dubai. We're going everywhere. Okay, the V partners are on the road. Everyone is flying around the world, guys. And I believe that the last two years of adapting, adjusting, accommodating made us stronger, all right? Helped us identify the true leadership that we have out there. We created world records with the VCCs, uh, with creating record max out kings and queens. We created new blue diamonds, guys. It's just a beautiful, beautiful freaking time for our industry network marketing and for us, the greatest e-commerce network marketing company in the world, QNet. All right, so if you're watching me right now, okay, and you're brand new, hi, I'm Chief Padman Senati Raja, and I'm as gorgeous as you thought I would be. If you've been around for a long time, if you're building, stop, started rebuilding again, facing a challenge, going through one of these crises that happens due to the fact that nobody truly understands network marketing, and sad to say the world is not ready to embrace us as the greatest concept of entrepreneurship, we can solve economic problems. We can um, abolish um, or eradicate unemployment. We are going to be the answer to all future and existing problems. But they're not going to embrace us immediately. So wake up, smell the coffee. All right, let's go with the flow. Do what we do best. And one day the world will hug us and say, thank you, Network Marketing. Thank you, QNet. Now we believe in you. And this week, I want to talk about something, you know. Um, I've been speaking to a lot of people, been speaking a lot to Dato Sri Vijay. And a lot of people ask me, you know, about my relationship with Dato Sri Vijay and myself. And it's a beautiful, amazing relationship of upline, downline, the greatest upline you can have, Dato Sri Vijay, pushes you, truly a coach B, all right? But he does it with love, and that's beautiful. And I was just thinking the other day, why am I so connected to Dato Sri Vijay? And today I give you the answer, all right? I realized a long time ago, and all of you watching, please listen carefully. I realized from the time I started 24 years ago that this journey to financial freedom is not going to be an easy one. So if you're brand new and somebody says, max out in, in, in you know, like that, they're lying to you. This journey is not easy. This journey is fantastic it's an adventure it's beautiful when you reach your destination you laugh at everything you cried about before that's a profound statement when you reach your ultimate destination of financial freedom you will laugh about everything that you cried about before on this journey okay let's think about it what what are we doing we are going against the grain we are challenging every traditional belief system that exists on the planet that study hard, get a good degree, uh, get a job, go to work, come back home, go to work, come back home, go to work, come back home, uh, retire when you're 60 and then pray that your children look after you. I've said this millions of times. And I believe that this journey is not easy, guys. Because from the time you sign up, like most of you, you're not here just to earn 250 or 500 US a month and upgrade from a two-wheeler to a small four-wheeler. That the majority of us participated in network marketing, made the decision to sign up with QNet because we wanted something big. 
We wanted financial freedom. We wanted to change our lives and the lives of people around us and people that depend on this, right? We wanted to be one of the big boys and big girls in this industry. And, and that is a tough journey. That journey requires a serious level of commitment. And I realized that in 24 years, there are good days and bad days, even for people like me. Today, I'm your upline. I'm your chief, guys. All right. I represent Japa and Dato Sri Vijay. I'm a direct referral of Dato Sri Vijay Ishwan himself. And let me tell you, I have had tough days. And today, I want to talk about it. You know, we always try to be super positive and only show the, the bright side of network marketing, hiding the reality. Sometimes, even though it's inevitable that everyone watching this Wednesday message you are either already facing the reality or you're about to face the reality of being an entrepreneur, of wanting max out or financial freedom. This journey is not easy, it's tough, all right? And many times during this journey, your belief system is, is shaken up, you know, it's, it's challenged. Your commitment is challenged, all right? Uh, the tough days can be a mix of everything from rejections to downlines leaving you to getting a relative or friend laugh at you because the day you told them that this is the greatest business on the planet, the very next morning there's headlines of some newspaper, some governments who doesn't understand us or some troll or some moron online who's criticizing uh, and defaming QNET as a scam or whatever it is, all right? Then you go back and you meet these people and they're laughing at you. Now, all of that can accumulate into a bad day. Now, let me tell you, as much as we are positive and I'm switched on and I'm super excited at four o'clock in the morning because life is beautiful when you're financially free, getting here was not easy. And I think the sooner you embrace that, right, the more prepared you are for this journey. Because remember, I wrote in my book and I said many times and Dato Sri Vijay has said it in his own style. You are not asking for a lollipop. You are asking for financial freedom. It's going to be a tough journey because what you're asking for is huge. You're asking for something that people dream about until they die and still not achieve it. You're asking for something less than 1% of the planet has. That's financial freedom. Now, is it possible? Living proof. Thousands of people in QNET are living proof. Your uplines, the V partners, AVPs, V councils. You, you heard their stories at VCon and many other occasions. But what you don't hear enough of how tough their journey has become. So right now, if you're watching this Wednesday message and you are experiencing the toughness of the journey, if you are at one point right now where you feel like, it's a bad, bad day. It's okay. It's okay. I've been there. All right? Uh, and it's part of our journey. And you know, I found the secret of how to survive this journey. And my secret is, is my upline, Dato Sri Vijay. When I have a bad day, I call him. When my belief system comes down, especially in the early days, it was tough. I go sit down with him and not address the topic of my belief system. Just be there to borrow some of his energy, you know, because he was at a higher level of understanding and embracing the toughness that is going, that you're going to face. But you see, guys, I don't think that you don't understand this. You just don't embrace it. Everyone knows that financial freedom is not going to be easy. Everyone knows becoming an entrepreneur is not going to be easy. Everyone knows, including you, that the industry of network marketing, QNet, will have tough, you know, moments where there is negative media and challenges and, you know, whatever it is. We all know that, but we sort of, we live in denial. And when we face it, you go like, oh my God, what happened? Why is this written? Why is that? Why didn't know so difficult? Why am I rejected? Why do downline squid? Why is my upline a moron? Whatever. Don't be surprised. Because I think I have prepared you. Everyone has prepared you throughout your journey. And the question comes back is how badly do you want this? You have to answer this question. Because until you answer this question, everything is going to be tough. 
let me tell you. But if you want it bad enough, how badly do you want it? I wanted financial freedom more than oxygen, guys. I was willing to die to achieve it. I made promises to my mom. You know, I made promises to a lot of people. I had, there was no option. There was no back door for me. There was no escape route. I had to do it. I had to face whatever I had to face. And I realized at that point that it's not that bad. Because today being financially free, right? And looking back at all those moments where I felt like quitting, like it was a tough day when the headlines of the newspaper was negative about our company and I wanted to jump off a cliff. And, and, the, and that night when I remember going back home and having tears in my eyes and my dining table, I look back today, I laugh. And I think, oh my God, what a moron. Do you understand? And I want you to realize this. That if you are going through the toughest moment on your journey of networking today, I promise you it's not going to last. Because my toughest moments did not last. It, it, it got over. And then I experienced the beautiful part of this journey. The checks growing, the, the lives you can change, the, the team that we built, the relationships, the bond of our team, our family. All right, my bond with Japa and Dato Sri Vijay, it's amazing. And I realized that that's the truth about this journey. That the tough moments will be there. And I guarantee you, whoever you are, whichever market you're building, there will be many tough moments. There will be moments where you feel like giving up. There will be moments that you look up in the sky and say, why? But then those moments will end. And the beauty of this industry, this journey will appear. The mistake people make, I believe, and I hope you don't make this mistake and I'm preparing you for it, are the people who quit during the tough moments. It's moronic, you know, and I don't get me wrong. I know why they quit. Because that moment was too tough for them to handle. And most of the time, it's too tough to handle because they were alone. Now, when I had my tough moments, I was not alone. I had Dato Sri Vijay. I had Japa. I had my leaders. I had the whole V to support me and so do you. And what mistake people make when they face tough moments, they go home alone, analyze it, self-doubt comes about, they question everything and then they quit. The minute you're going through a tough moment, that's when you reach out and you grab onto your uplines and spend time with them. I used to tell my downlines, if you're having a bad day, come stay with me. Because my house was filled with love and positivity Amma was here, you know, it's just amazing, you understand? And that's what you need to do. But it's okay to experience tough moments. We all did. But if you survive that tough moment, then you will see the rainbow after the rain. You know, you have to experience the rain to see the rainbow. Right? You have to appreciate life only when you go through tough moments. The same way. You appreciate financial freedom. You appreciate your uplines. You appreciate the V, Japa, Dato Sri Vijay, this industry. Only when you have gone through tough moments. So it's okay, guys. My only request to you, no matter how tough your journey becomes, don't quit. Reach out. There's somebody there who's going to hold your hand during your, your, your darkest hours. Whether it's your uplines, your downlines sometimes, your cross lines, the V is always there. All right? Japa and Dato Sri Vijay is always there. I am always there. Sunday, Wednesday, tough moments, log on to Instagram Live. Tough moments, watch Wednesday message. All right? Tough moments, go to my YouTube channel, all right? And just watch whatever video. Go to VTube, watch Japa and Dato Sri speak. The tough moments will always be there. At multiple points of our journey. And I think that's when you need to reach out and connect with your uplines and realize that you are not alone. Because most people who quit during the, the tough moments of our journey to financial freedom, and I speak to them, many of them are still in touch with me. And I ask them, why did you quit? And they said, I felt alone. And I couldn't fight this battle alone. You know, Chief, I was not a warrior. 
But let me tell you guys, the tougher the moment, right? The more you need your uplines, the more you need the family. And this is what network marketing offers. This is what the V offers. That you should never be alone during your tough times. Reach out, talk to us, reach out to your uplines, talk to anybody. But all I can promise you is, when I went through my tough times, I spent time with Datu Sri Biji. And I survived that tough times. You see, I always believe network marketing is not about success. It's about surviving the tough times. And the, just by the fact of surviving the tough times, I promise you, you will achieve success. That's ultimately the secret. So to all of you guys, stay strong. Reach out to your organization, to your uplines during your tough times. We all went through tough times. And I promise you, if you survive the tough time, if you don't quit, you're going to see the beauty of network marketing. You're going to experience that success, that financial freedom. I promise you that. So to all of you, whoever you are, newbie, veteran, going through some tough times, any of you, just don't quit. Stay strong. Reach out to your uplines, reach out to the V, reach out to anyone in your organization and just survive that tough time. It may be a week, a month, a day, but after that, I promise you, life will be beautiful. This is a fantastic industry, a fantastic business concept. All you need to learn is to survive the tough times and then you will experience what we all are experiencing right now unbelievable beauty of this business of financial freedom of this great industry that's what i wanted to tell you guys in the wednesday message stay strong survive and then you will see the beauty of this business love you guys